Photina from the Greek bright. The Greek Orthodox tradition gives this name to the Samaritan woman, protagonist of the encounter with Jesus at Jacob's well narrated in John's Gospel. The episode was recalled at Nabalus on Sunday, May 14 in the church that still houses the same well. Today is a great celebration for all Christians in the world, especially for Orthodox people. Today all Orthodox churches are reading the same Gospel passage. For this reason the Patriarch came from Jerusalem together with several priests from Palestine, Greece and Romania. We celebrate this festival each year on the fourth week after Easter. Samaritan Sunday is a holy day for the locals. Fotina, according to tradition, was baptized after the resurrection of Jesus and died a martyr's death in Rome, Italy. On the occasion of the festive celebration, the church that was dedicated to this saint welcomed dozens of faithful. We are Orthodox Scouts and we came here to play for this feast and to attend the Mass. This is the first time I have been here accompanied by the Scouts. I came here with my family several times before on the occasion of this feast. I came from Jordan to attend Mass and celebrate this reoccurrence. Everything here is amazing. Everything. Among the walls of the sanctuary, located in the heart of Samaria and whose first construction dates back to 384 AD, there was an atmosphere of both celebration and reflection. We love this monastery and we love to come back here to visit it and meet its leaders. We are proud of our Christian tradition here and in Palestine in general. This place is holy not only for the Orthodox people but also for all denominations who believe in one God. It is open to everyone. <laughs>